In this video, we're going to cover the must have and best accessories that you can buy for your Oculus Quest 2, the 2021 edition. Hi, my name is Pete and on this channel, we help busy entrepreneurs find the best tech, be productive and stay safe online. So let's get stuck straight in. Links will be in the description below for everything I talk about. And if there is anything that you think should be on the list, then leave it in the comments down below. And if there's enough interest, I'll go and buy it and give those a test as well. Going from cheapest to most expensive, first up is these lens covers from VR Cover. And this stops dust and protects against accidental scratches whilst generally just protecting the headset, you know, whilst you're moving it around. It does also stop my cat from his strange fascination of just licking the lenses. So well worth for the small price. Next was my previous complaint about the lens fogging up. Uh, well, by using these lens wipes specifically, it's pretty much solved these issues for me. They are great to both clean the headset and you know don't use your t-shirt whatever you do to clean the headset <laughs> it also just seems to reduce how quickly the lens foggy up so if you do struggle with it steaming up whilst playing you know box vr or beat saber then these are just for you next up we have the avmr grips which i've had for around six months or so and these things have stood the test of time really really well they still look new they haven't fallen apart and they just make the quest controllers more comfortable and more grippy and because of this strap you can physically let go of the controllers without dropping them, of course, which might sound silly, but you'll find that as soon as you do put these things on, you won't be gripping the controller as hard, which then means games where you are you know, picking things up or for first person shooter games, it's all that more immersive as you're not just constantly aware of these two like lumps of plastic in your hands. Next up, and only slightly more expensive than the uh, the last one, or basically the same price, I actually have two versions, which I'm swapping between very regularly. And these are also from VR Cover. These are the facial interface and foam replacement sets. And I absolutely love these. Uh, they generally just, they feel more comfortable. This is much more padded than the stock one. And it also just blocks out more of the outside lights. But I also like this silicon replacement set, which just fits over the existing uh, kind of headset cover you get. Next up, we're talking Quest Link. And if you aren't fortunate enough to have good enough wireless to wirelessly play games from a gaming PC, then I recommend getting one of these cables. It's not the official Quest Link cable, which is like hella expensive, but it does the exact same job with the caveats of well, being a little bit shorter. And it also doesn't have the right angle connection, which for me doesn't really cause any issues. Onto the head strap now. In, in my last video, I found a better alternative to the basic strap, which came with my Quest 2 from Amazon. However, I did finally get hold of the Elite strap after you know stocks were really running low last year. And I can definitely say that this is marginally more comfortable than the cheaper one but it's definitely a better build quality. Yes, it is double the price, but to me it is worth it to have something that I just, I know will last. I've had no issues with cracking or anything along those lines like I've seen online. Now I'll leave links to both of those in the description below in case you want to check out the more affordable version and you can always return it to Amazon if you don't get on with it. Also a quick note on the back of these headsets, that VR Cover also make a foam padding that sits back here, which gives you a more comfortable fitting. And um, so I'll leave links down below just in case that's something that you need as well. For a case, I have tried a few now and the official case just does it for me. It fits really, really nicely. It's a solid outer shell, which gives you great protection. And inside you can fit everything you need, providing you're not using things like battery packs, which can make the headset you know, much taller when you've got a battery on the top there. So you'll need to take those off to make your Quest fit. To charge your Quest 2, then the Anchor Charging Dock is definitely a must have, though they can be quite difficult to get hold of. But I have to say this works really, really nicely. It uses a magnetic attachment to quickly and easily charge your headset whilst putting it on the dock. And also it includes rechargeable batteries with some kind of adapters for your controllers, which will allow you to also charge those in the dock too. The only downside to this is that if you're leaving this in the open, then it can get a little bit dusty, but this is great if you are a daily user and want to easily pick up you know, everything without worrying that you need to change batteries halfway through. Go and watch this video next if you want some ideas on accessories for your PS5 or Xbox. Like, subscribe, all the things, and let me know what else you'd like to see down in the comments below. Thanks, see ya.